and welcome to ASC Academy USA. Today I will be reading Katie Ledecky Olympic Stars. I chose this book because I'm good at swimming. Star of the Pool. Katie Ledecky got off to a hot start at the 2016 Olympic Games in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. The 19-year-old swimmer had raced in four events. She won three of them. In the other event, the four times 100-meter freestyle relay, she finished second. It was the type of start many experts had predicted for Ladaki. But everyone really wanted to see how she finished. She closed out the Olympics with her signature event, the 800 meter freestyle. Katie Ledecky was one of the biggest stars in the 2016 Olympics. Ledecky do win. She led by nearly two seconds after one lap. Seven laps remained. With each lap, Ladaki pulled further and further away from the field. Before long, she was swimming by herself. Ladaki touched the wall in 8 minutes, 4 seconds, and 79 milliseconds. That smashed her own world record. The next fastest swimmer was more than 11 seconds behind. With that performance, Ladaki cemented her place as one of the stars of the Olympics. And still only a teenager, she might not be done yet. Ladaki celebrates her Olympic gold medal in the 800 freestyle. Ladaki races away from the field in the 800 meter freestyle. Fast fact. Ladaki holds the world record in the 1,500 freestyle as well, but only men in the long distance compete in the Olympics. A young star, Caitlin Juveni Ladaki was born on March 17, 1997 in Washington, D.C. Her mother, Jerry Nunn, had been a swimmer at the University of New Mexico, but it was really Katie's older brother, Michael, who got her into swimming. I just always enjoy swimming with Michael, and I think that's how I really found my love of the sport, Katie explained. Katie was born in Washington, D.C., but grew up in a nearby Maryland. By age 6, Katie was swimming competitively. She struggled at first. She could not swim a full 25-meter race without stopping to rest. Before one event, Katie set a goal. She was going to make it 25 meters without stopping. But a year extent sent her to the doctor before the race. She had a swimmer's ear. The doctor suggested she stay out of the water. Katie swam anyway. She met her goal. Growing up, Katie loved to swim. Setting goals became a way of life for young Katie. She started a list titled Wanted Times. There, she wrote down all of the performances she wanted to hit in swimming. She recorded each of her swimming times next to the goal until she met it. With the goals in place, Kitty began to dominate. Kitty celebrates a win at the 2011 U.S. Junior Swimming Championships. Fast fact. At age 9, Katie got to meet one of her idols, swimmer Michael Phelps. Katie beamed as Phelps signed an autograph for her. In the 2012, Katie shocked the swimming world. The 
15-year-old took part in her first senior national competitions in the U.S. Olympic team trials. Her best event was the 800-meter freestyle. She started out fast and never faded. Kitty touched the wall two seconds ahead of the second place swimmer. She was headed to the Olympics. Even Kitty had not expected to meet her goal so soon. Kitty races in the 2012 U.S. Olympic team trials. Katie was one of the youngest swimmers at the 2012 U.S. Olympic team trials. Katie races in the 2012 U.S. Olympic team trials. Fast fact, Katie was also placed third in the 200 meter freestyle and ninth in the 200 meter freestyle at the 2012 Olympic trials. Teenage Olympian Katie Ledecky traveled with the US team to London, England for the 2012 Olympic Games. She had never swum in an international competition before, yet she was not overwhelmed. I knew if I put my mind to it, I could do it, Ledecky said. I wasn't intimidated at all. She was right. The 15-year-old had one event, the 800-meter freestyle. She qualified for the final by swimming the third fastest time in the heats. Then she really turned it on in the final. She not only won the gold medal, but she also set a U.S. record. Fast fact, Katie's gold medal time of 8 minutes, 14 seconds, and 63 milliseconds in London was a U.S. record. It was less than a second of shy of the world record. The Ducky was the youngest member of the entire 2000. 12 U.S. Olympic team. The Ducky returned to the U.S. as a star. Her classmates greeted her at the airport with thunderous applause. But soon, life returned to normal. She went back to her swimming. She went back to her school in Maryland. She continued swimming. In two. 2013, the Ducky went to Barcelona, Spain for the World Championships. She proved her gold medal was no fluke. The Ducky won four gold medals. She set world records in both the 800 and 1500 meter freestyle races. The Ducky, right? swims away from her opponents yet at the 2013 World Championships. The Ducky was quickly becoming the biggest star of women's swimming. Swimming World Magazine named her the Female World Swimmer of the Year for 2013. In 2014, she continued to break world record after record, and she was named World Swimmer of the Year for the second time. Ladaki's stamina set her apart. Unlike most swimmers, she was able to surge ahead early without fading. Ladaki smiles after setting a world record in the 1,500 meter freestyle at the 2014 Pan Pacific Championships. In 2015, Katie continued to Katie continued her dominance. At the World Championships, she won a stunning five gold medals. She broke her own records in the 800 and 1500 meter freestyle events 
and she swam the anchor line for the U.S. four times 200 meter freestyle rugby team. Fast fact: In 2014, a North Dakota city named its new pool after Katie's grandfather. Officials invited her to be the first person to dive in. The ducky showed a dominant combination of speed and endurance at the 2015 World Championships. To Rio and beyond, swimming fans knew Katie Ladaki's dominance. Many believed she could become a huge star at the 2016 Olympic Games in Rio de Janeiro. There was a lot of pressure. K Ladaki did not disappoint. Her first race was on the first day of the Olympics. Katie held the U.S. four times 100 meter freestyle relay team won a silver medal. The ducky dives in to start her leg in the 4 times 100 meter freestyle relay heat at the 2016 Olympics. Kitty Wright and her 4 times 100 meter freestyle relay teammates show off their Olympic silver medals. The 400 meter freestyle final was on the second day. Ladaki won by an amazing 5 seconds. Her time, 3 minutes, 56 seconds, and 46 milliseconds was a world record. 200 meter freestyle was her next event. It was supposed to be her most competitive race, but she cruised to victory later too. The ducky was just getting started. Next, she helped the four times 200 meter relay team win a gold medal. Finally, she closed out the Olympic Games with her dominant win in the 800 meter freestyle. Fast fact, Ladaki set the 800 freestyle world record at 8 minutes 4 seconds and 75 milliseconds. Some people believe she could someday break 8 minutes. Anything is possible, she says. Ladaki was often far in front of the competition at the 2016 Olympics. After the real games, Ladaki was an international star. Companies offered her millions of dollars to endorse their products, but Ladaki turned them all down. If she took the money, she would have lost her amateur status. Instead, she enrolled at Stanford University for, to swim for the Canada team. I've always wanted to swim co college tunnel and have that experience, she, she explained. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. The ducky hands her Olympic gold medals to Washington Nationals star Bryce Hop Harper so she can throw a ceremonial first pitch. The ducky was one of the most popular 2016 U U.S. Olympians. Did you like this book? I hope you did. Please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Bye!